Welcome to the enchanting world of Frostwood, where the Winter Festival transforms the town into a magical wonderland. In this chapter, we follow the journey of a young woman as she navigates the bustling town square, surrounded by twinkling lights and the scent of hot cocoa. Join us as we explore the choices she faces and the warmth of community that envelopes her. Stay tuned to Storyteller for this captivating tale. Clara Thompson stood at the edge of the bustling town square, her heart a mix of excitement and trepidation. The winter festival had arrived, casting a warm glow over the snow-dusted cobblestones. Clara's bright green eyes scanned the crowd, searching for familiar faces amidst the sea of winter coats and scarves. Yet, beneath the festive atmosphere, Clara felt the weight of her discoveries pressing heavily on her shoulders. The photograph, an enigmatic relic from her grandmother's attic, pulsed in her mind, a constant reminder of the choice that lay before her. Should she reach back and alter a pivotal moment in her family's history, or embrace the vibrant present, alive with laughter and warmth? As Clara navigated through the throng, the past tugged at her, urging her to make a decision that could change everything. Jake Morales, with his tousled dark hair and mischievous grin, appeared at Clara's side, his warm brown eyes sparkling with enthusiasm. Clara, look at that, he exclaimed, pointing toward a booth where townsfolk gathered around a giant snowman, its carrot nose and coal eyes giving it a whimsical charm. Clara smiled, grateful for Jake's presence, his playful demeanor a balm to her swirling thoughts. But the joy of the festival was tinged with tension. The town elder, a weathered figure with a long gray beard, stood nearby, his gaze fixed on Clara with a mixture of concern and disapproval. Clara felt his eyes bore into her, a silent warning echoing in her mind. The elder had always been a guardian of Frostwood's secrets, and now, he seemed to view Clara's quest as a threat to the town's stability. As the festival unfolded, Clara's heart raced with the weight of her decision. The festival culminated in a grand celebration, the townsfolk gathering around a towering bonfire, their faces illuminated by the flickering flames. Clara stood at the edge, her heart pounding, as she realized that the photograph was not merely a tool for change, but a mirror reflecting her own journey. It revealed truths she had yet to understand, the interconnectedness of past and present woven into the fabric of her identity. In that moment, Clara made her choice. She would not alter the past. Instead, she would embrace it, allowing it to guide her as she forged her own path. The festival swirled around her, a vibrant tapestry of community and renewal, leaving Clara with a profound sense of belonging. As the first stars twinkled in the night sky, Clara felt a warmth spread through her, a quiet assurance that she was exactly where she was meant to be.